tears in court today as Rebecca Kinner admits that she did nothing to stop the beating of her two year old daughter, Kinsley Kinner. Rebecca Kinner pleaded guilty as charged to three separate counts, the most serious of which was involuntary manslaughter. Not on your side is the only station with a bureau dedicated to Butler and Warren counties, and our reporter, Jay Warren, has this story live. Jay? Well, the other two charges, permitting child abuse as well as endangering children. Now, tonight, for the first time, you are going to hear from Rebecca Kinner's father, Doug Kinner. He says of his daughter that she loved little Kinsley. Rebecca Kinner cried as the prosecutor read the statement of facts this morning that she did nothing last November as Brad Young beat and shook her two-year-old daughter, Kinsley, so severely that Kinsley died as a result. Yes, I do. No matter of being guilty, you'll be forever waiting or giving up your right to a trial. Yes. That's what you wish to do? That's what I wish to do. In court today was Scott Seneff, Kinsley Kinner's father. Seneff says when he sees Kinner and Young, he can do only one thing. All I can do is stare at them. I can't do nothing. I can't talk to them. I can't ask them why they did it. I can't do none of that. With all of the court hearings, Heidi Morgan, Kinsley's grandmother, describes a roller coaster of emotions. It's like a cycle. It really is because I'll get to where I need to be and then we come back to here and I, I want this done and over with. And after the hearing today, a new voice, Doug Kinner, Rebecca's father, talked to reporters about his daughter. You know, I know it's a tragic thing. That what's happened. Um, you hear, you've heard a lot of things um, one-sided about my daughter, and you know she really loved Kinsley. We all loved her. He believes he knows why his daughter didn't protect Kinsley. I I think he was threatening her. I recently found out that he was beating on Rebecca, and I think she just became afraid. Now, Kinner faces a maximum of 25 years in prison. Young's trial is scheduled for the end of April. Jay Warren, 9 on your side in the Butler Warren Newsroom.